down. But they're getting close. Picked up by Moore. Goes far right. Davies has to cut back in inside. The daylight suddenly disappeared in that corner. So St. Helens doing their job. And um, Davies, well, quite clearly, Davies is hurt there. Able to play. Garcia. Abdul puts the kick for Johnston to chase, has the bounce, there it is, and Catalan silencing the... Helens win tonight, and they strengthen their place at the top. Oh. There's a hit, and uh, Sione Matotia is being patted on the back by Conrad Hurrell for his efforts there. And they're going to make it as hard as possible here for Catalan to get out. Oh, right. Oh, any minute now, anticipation. St. Helens are 15 away. It's back with Dodd. Surinam uh, just tries to force his way through again, and it's taking some hard work to stop him in his tracks. But tracks were made. Clark to Dodd, and now on by, and Wellsby, good hands to take that pass and then produce one of his own. That was sheer class from the fullback. Conrad Hurrell will finish that. But when he's finished his celebrations, I'm sure he'll have a quiet word with Jack Wellsby to say thank you, teammate. World class. Yeah, thank you very much. But the pass was on half a second before. Jack Wellsby almost aborted that pass to Conrad Hurrell. But he was on the end again. A really good set-up shape. Jack Wellsby sweeping round the back. They got the depth, and it all came... minutes of the first half remaining, so it's just letting that ball bounce. That could have been a, a tough one, and that was a tough one. That is high. There's a reaction. Oh! There's the reaction. But after Dodd joins in and pushes Maria over, there's something else here. Look, the shot, it, but it's a reaction off the back of it as well that I think we need to see, because, look, whilst that challenge... He's on the top of the back and then he makes forceful contact with the head. So there is mitigation, but it's 10 minutes. Well, it's yellow. It's yellow. Saints fans feel it should have been red. So here's a moment. So nice fans will love. Iggy Parsi back on the field. 10 months away for Iggy Parsi. That horrific collection of injuries. MCL, ACL, ankle injury in that semi-final. Ten months ago in the Challenge Cup, and it's been a long, hard road back. Catalan line, but not found it on this occasion. Clark again. Farage came rushing out quickly there to uh, to close things down. Percy though, just into a gallop. Farage probably looked at him and thought, the best thing I can do here is get in his face before he gets full speed up. Now St Helens are going right, and Conrad Hurrell's travelling well despite that injury. Makinson's there too. But so too a cluster of Catalan defenders. And now it's Tommy Makinson's turn to be a little laboured as he picks himself up off the floor. Dodd will kick to the corner. It's uh, patted back and into the hands of Sione Matotia. Yeah, just picks up and has the easiest route to the line. And Lewis Dodd's just not giving up on that as he gets one arm to it. And that's your reward, Sione, for following up and not giving up on a play. An early score for St. Helens, a four-point lead, a kick from Percival to take it out to 12 points to six. And the only saving grace from this is that the kick will chew up an extra minute of Frank Maria's time in the Simbin. So, as ever, a muscular one from Delaney. Clark. Dodd. This is Bell. Can't spin it away, and Bay was standing behind, but... He's not going to get involved here because Clark has uh, jogged it back to that dummy half position and Bay has gone to that right-hand side, late run from him to try and create numbers. Wellsby is away from the attempted tackle and has support from Tommy Makinson, who's in to score. Bullseye from Tommy. St Helens have a second. When they're in this kind of mood, who knows? Who knows where it goes from here, but just at the moment, the Saints fans are very happy. A no, really, really well worked try, and it was a move just before the play the ball from Moses and By that created the extra number. The defence on the left hand side for the Catalan Dragons could end up having the way with the Catalan Dragons at the moment. Bell again skips in, Stevens is there, tight to him, and Stevens gets himself away, and he's still going here, carting it downfield. There were two or three to his left, but he was excited. Never in doubt. Yeah, had to get high, had to get the arms above the head, he'd done just that. Well, Wellsby running from dummy half, saw the gap, 
took advantage. Can he go the distance here? Trying to step back on the inside, but covered, covered the Dragons. Clark, Dodd, dummies, steps. Oh, and Desiree with a despairing tackle, but it's play on. Desiree did just enough to slow him down. One play to go. Kick to the angle area. And over goes Matty Lees. His first try of the season, if it's given. Massive moment, massive moment. Let's hear from the video referee. It's tackle five, the on-field decision to try. We're checking onside, offside, through to ground. So it's camera four first for the kick, please, and onside, offside. It's with more. Rouget to Busquet, and Busquet has got himself over. That cry of celebration.